Epic Games is going to lose about $330 million in its battle to eat Steam ground, especially for offering exclusives and free titles in the Epic Games Store. According to PC Gamer, Epic's legal struggle with Apple has shown how Epic spends what it takes in its store, even if that meant $444 million to maintain the exclusives in 2020 alone, this money is spent to try to offer minimum guarantees for games that are exclusive to the Epic Game Store for a year. Since these games will not appear on Steam, Epic offers guarantees such as advances to distributors whether or not their games are sold enough to cover expenses. For example, Epic spent $10.45 million to 505 games for having exclusive control during 2019. In Epic's annual report, the company confirmed that players spent $700 million on the Epic Game Store in 2020, but the third parties only contributed 265 of them. This reveals that they have yet to recover $444 million that they overtook the distributors, even if they are long-term agreements. According to Apple, Epic is going to lose at least $330 million. You can take a look if you want these predictions, pointing out that between exclusives and other expenses, the Epic Game Store could lose nearly $600 million in total by the end of 2021. And it suggests that in fact, the store would no longer be profitable until 2027. These estimates by Apple are from a summary of accusations that they plan to take to court to defend themselves from Epic for the problems that were generated between the two companies. Epic has already responded to this, saying that its estimate is that the Epic Game Store will start making money in 2023. In addition, while Apple says they lose money, Epic assures that they are not losing it, but investing.